You know what's going on, y'all. You know what it is, action. Um, so I'm in the grocery store the day before Christmas Eve here. I have never seen my grocery store in Susua this this pack. I must have bad word, but there's like a baby there. I'm like for real. Fucking packed. Like, yo, I ain't never seen this many people in the grocery store. It's the wildest shit. Everybody getting ready for Christmas. Everybody getting ready for Christmas. Oh, God. Seriously, there's usually, like, I'm usually through the line in, like, two seconds out here. It's crazy as fuck. I'll be sitting in line for, like, 30 minutes and shit. I got a Zoom meeting so I can work up Jura 30 with one of my homies from uh, Bandemic Billionaires. I'm sitting in here in the fucking line in the grocery store, like, like for real. And you should see the chicken aisle. They're all out of chicken. Chicken's done. Um, you know, if you want some chicken for Christmas, you waited too long out this motherfucker because it is done. No chicken for Christmas for you if you just came out tonight. I got my cigar. I got my fucking essentials. You know, so I'm good. I'm Gucci. Just kind of have to be sitting here for a while to get through this damn line. It's crazy as shit. Alright, I'll do it anyway. Take care of it. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas, Christmas Eve, because this is actually the 23rd. So this is the eve of Christmas Eve. Heck, I need to find another line, man. This lady got mad since the car. This shit wild as fuck. I haven't seen a line rush like this since the 2005 Walmart escapade, which was literally, my bad, bro. Which was literally like the night before Christmas. It was crazy. Walmart was crazy. People were running around killing each other for for uh, TVs and uh, workout weights and shit like that. No, I saw. I saw one lady beat another lady to death over some protein powder. You know that's some real shit right there. So, yeah. Anyways, I still gotta get my groceries tonight because I don't think the grocery store is gonna be open tomorrow. I don't want to starve on Christmas Eve or on Christmas Day, so I'm going ahead and get my chicken and my drinks and my Reese's peanut butter cups. And yes, I got a uh, fucking tres of leches in there. I don't really, you know, whatever the fuck. Okay, I get it, yes. It's not necessarily sticking to my match crows, but I need a goddamn tres like The shit makes me happy, a little bit depressed because, you know, I'm not at home with my son or no one else for Christmas. So just accept the shit and move on. That's what I had to do. Like, you know, I want my six pack abs. But if I keep eating Tres Leches and shit, I won't get them. So I have to accept that shit and move on. I have to pick one or the other. Either I'm gonna eat my Tres Leches and still have that little bit of belly fat, I'm gonna cut all that shit out and get my six pack. It's one or the other. You know, that's that's just what the that's just the fucking way it is. And like if really my man Martin been telling me that shit. My man Dave been telling me that shit. Jared been telling me that shit. A couple other people online through the West Watson network been telling me that shit, but like, yo, Trish Leche is good as shit. And when you go through some depression and bullshit like that, a Trish Leche will fix up your whole fucking mood and everything. Like, seriously, you might be like, oh my God, I hate life. I want to commit suicide. And then what happens? You eat a Tres Leches? You eat a Tres Leches? 
And it's all good. You don't want to kill yourself no more. I don't know if it's the sugar. I don't know if it's the milk. And that particular tres leches, it has caramel and fucking chocolate. So it might be the combination of both, but afterwards you're just like, oh, it's all good. I don't have to kill myself today. Without a tres leches. So look, yo, that's just the fucking way it is. Merry Christmas, like shit. Still fucking packed up. Y'all have a good one. I'll check you later. Peace.